There seems to be like this like frustration with you know in dating for men lately, and I'm just curious like if you felt it ever like dating 100%. women like, oh, it, like yeah. yeah it sucks. I just think it's a perspective thing, and you don't really get the other side if you don't have to experience the other side. Mm. So when I was dating men, I just truly didn't understand how, how awful I was being until I became a man, <laughs> and then I was like, oh. I was making so many things crazy for no fucking reason. For example, whoa. And it was like, but it's also a, it's also like a confidence thing too, right? It's the way women are positioned in society that causes a lot of these issues because women, we are taught to attach ourselves to men and that's where our value comes from. Now, you can talk a lot, you oh no, that's not the case. But at its core, it is the case. It yeah. is the case. And so, so much of you is... Reflected in the God. In uh, the God. And he has so much power. He has so much power to determine... Because you lose all your status if you guys to stop being together. To determine your existence, in a oh. way. And so you, you feel so... I didn't realize how powerless I was actually feeling in that position. Mm. And you were probably acting out because you felt powerless. Right, and, and, and yes, and, and, and being smothering and being all these things because your definition is so in relation to him. So, so if, you, if you leave me, I lose everything, so I gotta be on your ass so I don't lose everything. Yes. Oh. And that's why you say, <laughs> shit. Yo, fuck that shit, Tate, fuck that shit. You're, Sam's Wait, the new Andrew Tate. Yeah. Really. No, I'm saying. Uh, okay, listen, listen, listen. This makes so much sense. Yeah, Cause yeah, you've yeah. been to the other side, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> you're like Blade. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the gay walker? Without the Blade. <laughs> yeah. Gay walker, it's funny. Shay called me that. <laughs> really? Really? Oh, that's funny. <laughs> that's so funny. Okay, okay, okay. So this is all, okay, so the, the, wow. the jealousy, the smothering often comes from this idea that, that their identity is wrapped into who the guy is. Yeah. And maybe women don't even understand no, that. No, they don't because it's just a natural thing, right? Like, yeah. Like, Go like this when, right here. You got something on your nose. Oh, like when I had a boyfriend, I was going to, I was doing my thing. I was going to school and he was in college, but I felt such a need to like support him and make sure like his thing was good because it was like, as long as his thing's good, then our thing's good. And then mm. thus my thing's good, right? But in that you lose your, your own self identity and your own, like your own fight for your own life and autonomy, right? And, and then it wasn't until I became a, like a masculine of center lesbian that's out here dating women. Cause now everything changes, right? Now, and now there's different things I need to attract women, right? Like, as a woman to attract a man, all I got to do is show up. I just got to show up and not be the ugliest bitch in the room and, like, <laughs> something will come yeah. my way. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. once you're in a masculine position, it's like, you have all these requirements. You have to be able to protect somebody. You have to be able to provide for somebody. So by nature, you're going to be ambitious because getting the things is what gets you the pussy. Yes. It, the other way, it doesn't work that way. So you, you, don't, you don't need women to have shit to be with them. Mm. A bitch could be sleeping on another bitch's couch. You'll still fuck her. And if you love her, you'll just bring her into your home. Yeah, yeah, mm. yeah, but yeah. bitches ain't out here picking up homeless niggas. Yeah. Don't, it don't go that yeah, way. Yeah, yeah. So that change is just, you get what I'm saying? A hundred percent. Yeah, yeah. Whoa. Yeah, there's there's almost like... <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> no, but 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 it's like <laughs> whoa. These, <laughs> these reactions over here. <laughs> what you mean? Oh, that is real. Now <laughs> nah, 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 nah. nah, you're great. And I if you haven't seen Sam stand up, it's amazing. I've said this to you before, I'll say it again. She is female Patrice to me. And if you know how much we love Patrice, that's lofty, lofty praise. 100%. Yeah. But I've said that to you. I think when, you're fucking when you were great. Dating this dudes, is part were you of more it. femme or like would he come home and just dap him up and like, <laughs> No, I mean, I was I didn't really have a sense of my masculine identity. I, I was, I've always been some level of this, but it was definitely way more feminine. Oh, okay. Definitely way more feminine. Mm. Now, now, what you were saying before, like, in terms of, like, incentive for success, you were like, dudes are incentivized to succeed and be ambitious because that's how you get the girl. So, as a girl, like, my mom was, was very successful. You know what I mean? Like, is that... You more unique that you find a woman that is incentivized for success that has nothing to do without attaining. I think the dude. See, so it, and of course, there's always going to be nuance yeah. to this, right? Yeah. There's always there's no nothing is sweeping, nothing. Yeah. But I think it's also right. A little bit of it is class too, mm. because a certain class level, you need to as a woman, you're trying to attract a certain type of man at a certain level, right? So it's like, oh, I need to go get these things because it allows this type of if stuff. If I'm not this, then I can't date the guy who went to Ivy League or something like that. Mm. Also, there might be another a little bit of nuance where it's like, 
if you are incredibly passionate about a thing, that passion drives you and then success comes with the passion. Yes. Where it's not, you're not going, I just need status. You just love, like yes. my mom danced or whatever, but like you just love a yeah, specific yes. thing. Yes, yes. And so, so have you yes. felt... Just to the passion of it. hundred percent. And that's the main thing, right? Like the main thing too is like a lot of times it, you, I think I find, I've always found, like it's like when you're, when you're in a masculine, you have to identify all this stuff kind of earlier because you need it to do shit. Mm -hmm. Like you gotta. You're saying as you, in your position. Yeah, like you gotta, <laughs> because you can't like. You have to learn a new identity almost. Yeah, and you can't, like, you can't. I had a, yeah, because it's like, I'm used to going out and niggas buy me drinks. I'm used to go, I, I could go out yeah. with no money, really, yeah. and still have a night. And then I'm out here in masculine and, like, bitches are like, what's up? And I'm like, damn, I'm broke. So now <laughs> my mind is like, yo, I can't be a broke nigga. I got to figure out hmm. what I'm going to do and with the my ambition. life. Yo, there's yeah. no such thing <laughs> because as a broke I'm, girl. I'm going to get... Yeah. Fucked up. Like, I'm yeah. not gonna be able to get bitches. I'm You're not competing. gonna be able to have. Now I'm competing. Now I'm in a race. I'm watching other niggas wow. money. They're getting more. They're they're getting their women are more attracted to them. So it's like, oh, okay, I gotta be able to play this game. Wow. All right, guys, we're gonna take a break for a second because you never know what could happen to you in your life. What you do need is Morgan & Morgan. That's what you need. Morgan & Morgan is America's largest injury law firm. They have over 100 offices nationwide and more than 800 lawyers. Listen, with over $15 billion recovered for their clients, Morgan & Morgan has proven track record of fighting to get you your full and fair compensation, okay? Submitting a claim to Morgan & Morgan, it's like ordering takeout, then hiring a lawyer. So if you're ever injured, you can check out Morgan & Morgan. Their fee is free unless they win. Think about that. There's no cost unless they win. For more information, go to forthepeople.com slash flagrant or dial pound law. Okay, that's pound 529 from your cell phone. That's forthepeople.com slash flagrant or pound law.